Today we're gonna demonstrate installing sunrise half round copper girders on this small slate roof. The parts we need are, first of all the girders, six inch European style, two in caps, sunrise half round in caps, one sunrise half round pipe outlet from six inch girders to four inch round shape downspout, sunrise half round fascia brackets and then to mount the downspout we're gonna need two sunrise downspout brackets three elbows four inch round shape and one offset elbow we will use two inch stainless steel screws to mount the fascia brackets on the fascia board and we're gonna use this gray silicone to seal the in caps and the joints between the two pieces of gutters we're gonna make them as one piece also we will use the copper rivets first we're gonna measure the length we need Now we're marking the center of the dance part where we're gonna open the outlet. We're gonna install the sunrise half round pipe outlet. Now we'll bend the 
Goopy, she's back. And that's it. This is how you install the backup. Very smooth opening. That's why this gutter doesn't need cleaning. Sunrise half round in caps. Sunrise half round in caps are the only ones that comes with three punched holes showing where to put the rivets. Now we're gonna mark to install the sunrise half round fascia brackets. And we do it on a 20 inch span. You can do on every 24 inches because sunrise half round fascia brackets are wider and stronger than any other in the market. Now this is sunrise half round fascia bracket. Let's mount them on the gutters, on the ground, which make the installer a lot happier, save a lot of time. This is a front feed tab, and this is the rear feed tab. Oh, this is the front tab bent against the front bead. Installing sunrise facial bracket. Now I'm gonna show you how to tie two pieces of half round gutters together. First, we're gonna measure the overlap, how much they're gonna fit within each other. So they're gonna overlap four inches. And we're gonna bend this one out because this is a piece gonna carry the other one this is the one has the outlet in it so the other section of gut is gonna feed into it and because this is the one carrying it we're gonna put a bead of silicone here 
within the overlap. And I bend it the opposite way. The opposite of what we did with the outlet piece. So this will overlap or fit inside the other one nicely. Now we're gonna seal within the overlap. As we showed you, we marked four inch. It's gonna be the overlap between the two pieces. So within this four inch overlap, we're gonna put a bead of silicone. This bead of silicone gonna stay hidden forever. And gonna give gonna live for a hundred years for sure. So as you see the silicone is hidden. Now we're gonna drill a couple holes to put two rivets. rivets are more than enough. Matter of fact, you don't need rivets if you're putting the pieces together on a rivet. Now, this is the seam, and we measured in a way that the seam gonna be covered with a fascia bracket, and all will be the same span. So now we covered the seam with a fascia bracket. As you can see, these two pieces of guards are joined in a nice way, and they have four inch overlap without the need for any connection piece that other brands they use and make the thing look flimsy and less strong. Now we're gonna mount uh, the guards on a fascia and we're gonna use two inch stainless steel screws to mount the copper guards. We use the stainless steel screws on all our jobs and we recommend to use the stainless steel all the time. Let's go up and mount this piece of gutters using the four foot level will guarantee a nice descent toward the outlet.
Now we're gonna install the downspout. And we're gonna cut about four inch overhead between the two elbows. The elbow has a narrow end and a flared end. So beautiful. Now we're going to rivet the two elbows in a piece between them all together, as you can see here. First we made sure they lined up nicely. Now we're ready to install the pipe. First, we're gonna locate the pipe brackets on a corner post. This corner post is perfectly plumb. Downspout brackets with a 3.9 inch bolt screws. We put this in place to figure where we're gonna put the lower bracket. We marked three quarter inch above the offset elbow. Now we're gonna make sure it's in the center.
gonna pre-drill for the upper. Clean the cut and straighten it. Now the job is complete. Installing sunrise half round gutter system. You can see that's a six inch European style half round gutters. Sunrise in cap, sunrise facial bracket. Sunrise downspout outlet. And the sunrise downspout brackets.